Gonna be caught out by this smoke. Does the best he can with the kinetic field, but will still be going down five to six now. As we make the future find another opening. It's a, just a support, but they're in a good position to be able to take control of this middle tier one tower. Nip. They're actually uh, gonna contest this one. They've got the ultimate from Seal Kid ready to go. Limp makes the immediate blink over to the side. Bloodseeker is gonna try and challenge Limp while his blink is on cooldown. The Warlock Golems get dropped. Bloodseeker desperately needs to be able to pick up this kill. The Yule Scepter gonna be able to give him some time and Bloodseeker will go down. Limp actually gets healed up and makes the blink play away. Meanwhile, on the left-hand side, Jarcopter getting controlled by great glimpse out from Hanskin, pulling him back into a bad position. Jonas and Fon trying to get in Klitsinski, but can't quite get that kill, so it looks like instead they'll just have to content themselves with the goal. It looked like for a second that fight was gonna go that just had so much of Blimp's play, pulling back the Gyrocopter, He's still does not have too. the BKP. The ultimate is bringing him low, and now Era comes in, but immediately Telekinesis called down. He's in trouble, has the mech, but he immediately blows up. Does manage to get off the ultimate, plus the Winter's Curse, controlling some heroes, but now the turnaround. Ruby manages to steal that one, and Limp, he doesn't have a blink either. Double kill for the Bloodseeker, his ninjas in pajamas. Struggle to be able to defend that off-lane tower, but he dearly for it. was lighting up for all right, tier three tower down. This is we make the future's opportunity to cripple ninjas in the pajamas in this first game. The smoke up already from Limp. Looking for his opportunity for a big sonic wave. is gonna go in the background. They're gonna go for Klesinski first. Try and pop him. The sonic wave combo. misses, but they're still controlling him. Meanwhile, the vacuum does manage to get a couple there with a the wall rep cut, but Era is gonna be forced back. Witch Doctor Ultimate is on top of him, and so too does the Golem fall against Seal Kid. They easily pick up that kill. Klesinski will go down, but he already got off what's important. The Golems are out. Two other cores are still okay. Bloodseekers trying to fight up, protect the Gyrocopter as best as possible to TP away, but a Yule Scepter and a Vacuum Bolt there to be able to stop him. And now Glimpse back. Bloodseeker is going to be caught as well, and we make the future. Is he, though? Um, is he going to be so caught up? damn fast. Limp ahead of him. They need a Disable. Who has it? Oh, they didn't get anything. That's what I mean. You're, <laughs> you're not catching up to that. When half of your team is low and he's running at 700 speed, might be what pumps them to go for the high ground if they want to. They really need to be able to take a good fight here. Ultimate goes out, blink away. Yono Safan gets some distance. It looks like enough to be able to escape. Now Winter's Curse being laid down. There goes the Gyrocopter, and he will be able to get off the Golems as well. Eric gets off a really good ultimate, though, right in the middle of everybody. Bloodseeker's on his tail, though. A man fight between the two turns into one versus three as Bloodseeker goes down. So too is the SF fall. Gyrocopter dies inside of the Roshan pit, and Limp desperate for an escape here. One second to a blink. Oh, what a vacuum! Three-man vacuum from Yonasam with the wall on top. All of are going to be forced into a TP out except Klesinski. Oh, he doesn't have he one. He doesn't have one. It's on cooldown. That's but what so a huge. save there from Yonasam Fon. That could have just been the game right there. That was a really good fight for We Make the Future. They take out a lot of the cores. That could have just been, okay, well, you know, now we're still in this game. They can't really go for the Roshan. He's going to challenge. Limp, though, oh, he's got no HP and, more importantly, no mana. So, Roshan, who was already low, is going to be taken nice and quick. Seal Kid coming in. Oh, has the Winter's go Curse. It. He's really going to try this one. Air's coming in as well. Yoda Safan, they managed to get the Gyrocopter, the Aegis. And now the fight's going to turn bad for Ninjas of oh, Pajamas. Air's Zara, so low they're going to be forced into the BKB. Gets off the ultimate. The cast continuing to bounce around between the two supports in the back. Gyrocopter will lose his Aegis now. As the bounce goes over, Limp actually trying to get back the Bloodseeker. Pull back right next to the Gyrocopter. Easily able to take him out with the Sonic Wave. Gyrocopter round two, but doesn't have the flat cannon. Just using his rock barrage and the right clicks, but he's not actually doing enough damage to take down any one hero. They're turning and fighting him. Gyrocopter goes down. Era even getting away with the Glimmer Cape and the Cold Embrace to save. Klesinski using that extra damage, trying to finish off any one hero, but he just can't. Klesinski's going to go down as well, and they will clean up every single hero of We Make the Future as the Rubik only delaying the inevitable at this point. And he does a good job of trying to juke, but Limp is going to get... Wait, he died? What? And what? He died to, um, he died to, to Fatal Bonds, but We Make the Future, uh, they've actually spotted this one out in a way. Their top river ward, let's see. Smoke's going to be able to...
able to catch a couple here. Glimpse back, and they're going to try and control Klesinski as best as possible. Sonic Wave goes out. Still not enough burst damage, though. He has the mech as well and will fall back and survive. Yonas Amphan's going to be picked up by the Telekinesis. Surge is stolen. Not much there, though, Era. Prompting the ultimate. Ooh, great cast is going to be able to do a lot here. Limp on the side is going to try and blink away from the Bloodseeker. Ultimate goes out from Era, but the supports are low. Era fighting up against Glazinski. Can't get that kill either. Gyrocopter now chasing for more. Bloodseeker is going to be able to catch up to Limp. It looks like the silence will land and finish him off. Jonas Avon up next as he's already low enough. Back over to Era. Looks like BKD going to be popped. TP out. He will be successful. Jonas Avon, he's not getting away from this one. It looks like Blink is not going to be up in time. Double kill for the Bloodseeker, and we make the future. Right back in this game, ready to five-man down mid. He got out by that smoke. I mean, both teams right now are desperately just trying not to lose uh, near their base. Because that would pretty much mean racks for either side. And the Roshan is going to be in so much, but it's so much easier for the Dire to just get the high ground. And they're actually going to bring back the Rubik. Do they have vision of this? Yes. Clever Cape. Sounds getting laid down by the Bloodseeker, though. Does create a little space. Already Era has been ruptured up. Golem's being dropped. Here Seal does get off a Winter's Curse with a vacuum on top. Wall over. Yeah, but Gyrocopter still manning up against Era. Ultimate goes off from Era. Fighting up one versus two. We'll be able to claim one. Needs and now the Bloodseeker, he's going to go down as well. The Yule Scepter now the complete turnaround as Era will survive through all of this. Oh, it he looks still like. doesn't go down. Five heroes down on the side of We Make the Future. In the so might as well buy out the uh, the SNY, not going to be able to hold out for the investment. Nera starts pushing forward. He's got the cheese to back him up, so he can be the frontliner here. Already the Winter's Curse being placed on the Bloodseeker. They also use the ultimate now. Vacuum actually pulls him outside of that one, and the Glimpse fails as the BKB is activated, but Era is still beating into the Bloodseeker pretty hard. Now that the Witch Doctor ultimate is laid out, Era needs some help here pretty desperately. He does have the cheese as well as the Satanic, and he just starts healing back up. He doesn't even need that cheesy man fights the Gyrocopter and forces him back to the Fountain Limp. Gonna try and pick up that kill still, but it's gonna be forcing to a blink away. Ultimate being threatened. Era eats the cheese and now can pop the ultimate as they're all grouped up with the vacuum. Over three will be able to catch two and a third falls as well. We make the future start falling back to their fountain, but there's just no escape whatsoever as Limp man fights now against the last two. Forcing the gyrocopter back. Glimpse on and will be able to finish off. Full five man wipe as ninjas in pajamas be taking this game. There's only one buyback and that's from the Gyrocopter. There's no way he can one versus five this. Yeah, I think he realizes it too. Maybe they play after the Mega Creeps, but even then, it's so difficult because your team isn't really in a position. Maybe they just want to go for one more though, with the Refresher Double Rock. Uh, but they might just lose Mega Creeps for this and that's most likely what's going to happen. I think NIV uh, recognize that. They could have probably even come up for the throne at this point, honestly. But this is the absolute way to secure that nobody's just gonna save you by that monster. IP killing all the buildings right now. Make a creep's hand even diving in for a witch doctor. Hanskin almost dies there for a witch doctor. No chance to survive against that. Still though, we make the future are going to be uh at least four up rather soon, 20 seconds. Golem being dropped, second round being dropped as well. Managed to get the uh, vacuum though, pretty well stolen by the Rubik, but it just doesn't matter. Era's too big, Satanic allows him to heal back up to full once again. And limp, oh, Yule Scepter to dodge.